Hello, hello everybody and welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Today's video is an exciting video because I will be taking you through what I was up to throughout the week of my partner's birthday. We weren't able to do too much because of the weather. The weather, the weather was very, very, very bad. It was cold and rainy and windy. But we tried to make the best out of it and i made sure that we went out to try out new things that i we don't usually do like i don't drink wine but then we decided okay let's go wine testing and then we went to this very very beautiful wine estate when i say beautiful <laughs> baby i mean beautiful it was so beautiful i you guys are gonna see it i couldn't even believe that there's places that look like that here like everywhere i was standing like everywhere i went to take a picture a video it was just so magnificent i had so much fun there's two different places at the wine estate there's a deli and when i arrived at the deli um the lady that received us there was like oh she's still mostly i was like ah oh, donkey oh. uh and then she continued to speak to me in person and i was like mm -hmm. But I couldn't respond, but she never noticed that I, I can't really speak it like that. But then, yeah, I was just, you know, conversating with her because I could kind of get what she was saying. It's the people at the daily. It's so nice that like, the way they received us was so warm, so we're coming so professional, and I really like that. Like the waitress that saved us, oh, I give her five stars. She was good, she was good, she was good. And she recommended food that I actually liked weird enough. But yes, I actually have my five. The wine estate is so artistic i don't know like how to explain it the architecture that was going on there is so artistic like you would not believe how artistic it was there was this white little box i think that's where everybody wants to get pictures i'm gonna show you i'm gonna put everything there i'm just here to tell you guys to put you through what i was going through i don't want to talk too much because usually i talk too much la, 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 la. so i'm just gonna make this really short and then continue to explain it to you throughout the video but anyway you're gonna see what i what i'm talking about right now and then Before we left the deli, we decided to make a booking for the wine estate. Like when we arrived, just asked the lady to make a booking for us at the wine estate, and we made a booking for two. We get to the wine estate they're telling us we need to sit outside and if you see this restaurant for the wine is beautiful i wasn't even able to sit inside i was so angry because i was telling the guy that said this i think his name was christopher <laughs> that guy i gave him a minus 10. his attitude first of all was on minus it was a minus why are you holding a grudge huh mandela once said holding a grudge is like drinking poison and hoping the other person dies so you coming with a bad attitude is not gonna change my life hello you come in with some attitude that makes me feel like what's up with you though i really did not like your service though really i was gonna buy a lot of wine because i actually liked quite a few but then i remembered why must i buy wine and give this guy like a big bill and make him feel like he was actually giving me good service no so i only bought one so next time please tell the people that are serving people to learn how to serve people correctly because some of us are going to give you a bad review okay that's for the future people that are going to be saving. Um, it's 13 percent alcohol that was on the mouth and on the nose you get it of green apple um green pepper as well as well as lime and lemon mm. the other one is called the christopher lazen Blanc de noir Blanc de noir means it's a white this wine one. made from red grapes 
make them 100 shiraz grapes quite easy drinking one of your light bodied wines on the mouth and the nose you're getting some strawberries raspberries as well as red berries please do enjoy thank you thank, thank you, you. It's um, made from um, two cultivars, Simeon and Sauvio Blanc, um, mm -hmm. 13% alcohol. It was on French oak barrels, 500 liters for about nine months. On the mouth and on the nose, you get hints of apricot, beeswax, as well as nutmeg. Um, and the other one, the red one, is the Christopher Lazen Vunga Red Blend. So it's a blend of two grapes, Cabernet Sauvignon and as well as Pinot Touch. Also quite easy drinking, one of your light bodied wines. Um, it was on steel tanks for about nine months as well. On the mouth and on the nose, you get hints of dusty earth, dark chocolate, milk chocolate, as well as juicy bread. Please do enjoy. Thank you. So I'll start with this one. This is the Hazendal Chardonnay 2018 Vintage. It's 13% alcohol. It was on French barrels, 500 liters for about nine months. Um, so it's made from 100% Chardonnay grapes as well. In the mouth and in the nose, you get hints of creaminess, buttery, as well as these ones. So the other one is the Hazendal Chenin Blanc 2018 vintage, 13.5 alcohol. It was on also French oak barrels, 500 liters for about nine months. Um, made from 100% Chenin Blanc grapes. On the mouth and in the nose, you get hints of honey ginger um, as well as nutmeg please do enjoy you spin like a whirlwind in my mind every day and through the night oh you
decided to go and try a seven course meal yeah so that seven course meal when i arrived at that restaurant guys if i tell you that the service in this country like i have never ever ever ever, ever received such service in any country in the world include especially in this country like this bad service here people are always giving attitude i don't know why like do i look like the person should give attitude or maybe i get it people have said that i intimidate them but no i do not intimidate you you are intimidated there's a difference okay so when we got the the service first of all most of the people serving there i must say they were actually caucasian most of them that is not all of them but most and one thing about um caucasians is that they're about their money they can hate you but put the hatred aside and serve you like a princess either you princess of england or uk or whatever now when i got there guys i'm telling you like this is true story you know when you enter a lot of restaurants you have to ask the waiter excuse me waiter where's the bathroom where's the bathroom when i got there i was like i'm sorry i'm late you know i was getting those places a bit difficult to find and they're like no it's okay don't worry about it you're here now i was like oh what service is this <laughs> wait a minute do they think i'm queen a little bit or something hello <laughs> it's just me okay and the, the service was so good the guy was like the toilet is over there please make sure that when before you stand up from your table please wear a mask most of these restaurants are just like, wear a mask ah 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 do we have a problem sir hmm? do we have a problem what's that but anyway he was like please wear a mask when go in the bathroom and it was just so warm it was, it, it was welcoming and it was warm I, guys i don't know how to explain this you have to you have to experience it yourself you have to experience how good the service was yourself <laughs> to see they give us this little drink they're like in an eggshell so they're like on a bird nest so they, they look like an egg but they're not eggs they have a straw and then you drink and then i was like oh my god what kind of drink is it i've never tasted a drink like that before in my life i was like whoa 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 ask for the drink because i've never drank any drink like that so they said okay i'm gonna check the kitchen some restaurants will be like no nah, this drink is not meant for you to be drinking they literally made a cocktail out of the drink that we asked for and they were like you were the first people that we've created this cocktail for i was like what so we we made you guys create a cocktail wow oh you should name it me <laughs> she gave me my name okay it's a thai dressing okay and for the salmon as well how we want to be eat it so you will see it's resting on a burnt lime. The idea is that you squeeze that lime of course, so that lime just absorbs, and then you can take it, try take it all at once as you can. Okay, and um, yes. how do we eat it? So you need to squeeze the lime that it's sitting on, a half lime. Oh, this one. Make sure that you squeeze the lime so the lime just absorbs into itself. And then yeah. you try okay, taking it all at once, almost like a shot. With almost like a shot. Sorry? We eat it with hands? No, no, you squeeze the lime, don't eat the whole lime. You can... No, no, I mean like with our hands. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. And then on the side, lamb roti with a chipotle marrow. But with that one, you will see there's a bone in the middle. It should slide out very easily. Put it in here. Oh. All right, so that's Thank all. Thank you so much. Have you ever watched um, MasterChef? You've seen that food that they always create that looks like art, that looks like... It's just art. Let me just say it's art. Like, it is art. And when I used to look at it, I used to be like, ah, this food is probably tasteless. Because if you're going to put in that much time to make the food look good, I mean, is it going to taste as good as it looks? And none of the food I've ever eaten here tastes that good. Truth be told, when the first meal came, it was so soft. And when you eat it, the flavors just start to burst in your mouth. Like, oof. I, can't I cannot explain to you guys what it tastes like because I have honestly 
never eaten food like that before i don't know what to say it tastes like i have no idea like seriously that was the starter and i was like if this is the starter <laughs> then i don't know there's no meal that they brought that wasn't excellent it was a hundred it was a thousand out of a hundred honestly every meal that they brought from how artistic they made it look to how it tested to how different it tested it was just so beautiful honestly very professional from yo like i, I always had someone saving me we had so much fun and dip it in here thank you yes Thank you. Two green purees. So the light one is lime marmalade, the darker one, coriander pesto. Okay. Uh, in the center, we've got a little uh, in house kimchi, and on top, pork trappings. Bon appetit, guys.
What else to say about this restaurant? It is fabulous. The restaurant is meant for people that understand what fine dining is. And honestly, I've always, 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 always wanted to know what fine dining is. And once I found out what it was, I just want to do it every day. I even wanted to sleep at the restaurant. I was like, can you adopt me? Please, please, take me in. Take me in, adopt me. Don't worry, I'll just eat free food every day. That's what I'm going to do. Nothing else, just eat free food. <laughs> and tell the chef how nice this food is. But they were like, no, no, mm -mm. we can't adopt you. You gotta go. But yeah, it was beautiful, really. Thank you so much for having us, La Colombia. You guys are the best restaurant in Cape Town. When you guys said you were the best restaurant in Cape Town when I arrived, I was like, what is this one talking about? But after I felt your service and I ate your food, I concur. I agree with you. You guys are the best restaurant. In Cape Town, other restaurants might look, must look up to that restaurant. Trust me, they must. It might not be your cup of tea. Some people will come back here and say hey, that restaurant is work. But for me, I liked it. You don't hear too. You don't hear loud music. You don't. It's chilled. Sometimes you need that vibe to get your mind to think. Oh wow, how beautiful life is. It slows you down. It slows. You don't have to do 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 do. do. I've actually changed the way I do things now. Like in my house, I've decided that before I go to sleep, I play abstract music, eh, blues, jazz, because that type of music makes you be in a mood to just be calm, very, very calm. So yeah, that's why I liked it. I kind of like this one though. That's nice color for you. Wait, <laughs> thank you. What do you think? I like both of them, literally. Yo, um, they have Monopoly. They have a lot of games actually. They, get they even have this game. They might have the games on it. Yo, come on. So I hit a new meet King Kong. I don't know why he's killing Simba. He passed his son. Hey, Simba, why do you look like Simba? Why do you like that, boy?
Welcome guys to the apartment. Look at this. And yeah, bathroom. And it's just a tiny little bathroom. Looks like that. Some nice paintings. Over room. It's cold as hell, no cop, no kisser. But it's so cold. <laughs> On her toes. We got a Christmas tree, even though it's not Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we got a sitting place, we got a sitting place. And we got to the mat. We got Buddha. This is a guest bathroom. There we go. There. Uh -huh. which one is where are you? <laughs> which one is the poetry? <laughs> okay, wait, my way to be here. I make your own if it's easy. <laughs> Come, you have already in my video. See, my nephew is so nosy. He just wants to be all over my stuff. Say no. Come be my video. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Yo, look at that. Oh, 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 oh. So yeah, look at this place. Oh, and I don't have makeup on. So follow me to the second room. This is the master's bedroom. Ah. Oh. I thought that I thought this one was mine. <laughs> yeah. Are you dreaming? Because uh, that one had an ensuite. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
Some more towels, daisy panties, and dope ass panties. We got the uh, ABCs for people who don't know them yet. And then we got our dead's toes. My toes look cute, but okay. Then we have a bunch of flowers. Are these real flowers? No. They so dark. Look real. You see that? For real. I like this place. Like this is where people must come when they come and take a picture of them. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Pow. Pow. You come in, come over here. Another one. Take a picture. Pow. Another one. Pow! See the whole stands. Pow! So it's pow, boom, kind of pow, bam. Okay. We just got here. We just in the chill zone. Like the place is so quiet, it makes you just want to be in a silent place but i'm feeling so cold because it's very cold here and my phone's gone off so now i have to use my camera to shoot and i should have put a mic on it because i'm not sure how good you guys can hear me with this but yeah yo it look like top building like just the vibes it, did, it does yeah, it looks amazing. should we put the mics the mic do you have a mic i bought yeah, damn, damn. it's I'm so good. This look like you are in a hotel with. Yeah, it looks nice. Yeah, okay, so guys, I know that this thing looks crazy. Don't mind this, we will transform. <laughs> <laughs> it transforms us. <laughs> Yo, it looks so good. Yeah, yeah different being in this thing outside. Yeah. invited just a few people that are very very close to us and it was really nice i had activities planned for that day drinks everything food everything was on was on point but then at the end of the night someone came that wasn't invited i did not invite that person they were a friend of a friend and then they came with the person look one thing i'm gonna say about people learn to have manners please 
they, if there's something I do not like is a person who does not ma does not have manners that person is called mannerless I do not like people who behave like that that is a toxic trip and you need to leave it at your house you understand because when you come around me and you don't have manners like I said before I might look calm and cool and like I don't like trouble but if you bring trouble I'll be like what's up if you come in at 90 I'm gonna be at 150 so what's up do you want this smoke but anyway this story is not for that okay I made a video for that already you guys go check out that video and understand what I'm talking about right now I cannot spend time trying to kill my vibe because of other people's bad behavior nah, 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 nah. the next video is gonna be explaining to you the drama that happened the party and everything so watch out for the next video also if you know you're a babele person do me a favor don't come to my events because i get crazy and you wouldn't like it if you see the other side of me remember gemini's have two sides the good side and the bad side be sure to only stay on the good side because when we flip we become the bad guy you won't like that Enjoy the video guys and don't forget to like, subscribe and share your friends. <laughs> subscribe is very important actually. The most one, the most important is subscribe, like, comment. Those are those are things you need to do. Just to show me that you appreciate and I'm appreciated and you guys appreciate the content that I'm bringing for you guys. So thank you so much guys for watching this video and good night.